Welcome back to another exciting issue of Top 13 Content Creators Showcase with Bear Essentials with Bear Buyers. It's time to see where the hard work of each one of these content creators landed them on the countdown or if they were completely left off the countdown. Four-way tie at 13th place, Ganache Gaming, which recently I just seen a video of his that he may be done with Division. Uh, he's a more PvP kind of guy, and he was saying that the PvP is very stale. But there's some good news on that. We do hear that maybe there's some PvP content coming in year four, or maybe a lot of it. You never know. One of the persons tied uh, with this four-way tie at 13th place was yours truly, uh, Bear Essentials with Bear Buyers. Uh, all these people had 16 points. Actually, this week, uh, the week uh, 37 and week 38 has seen a big jump in the number of videos, um, mostly because the PTS and the uh, recalibration station stuff like that I think has energized a lot of people. We got a lot of new content creators too. Uh, Anthrex360, uh, not always here on the countdown, but he was really covering the division this week and that earned him 16 points and he's here on the countdown as well. Like I say, a lot of that uh, PTS has been covered now. Anything that they covered on the PTS kind of falls in the news category. It doesn't matter if it's a build or anything else like that. A stream is still a stream, but um, pretty much the PTS, because who knows if it's going to change. You can't put a build out there uh, and call it uh, uh, in stone because everything could change. Jumpstart Gaming. First time that we found him on the countdown. He's a very new content creator. It looks like he just started his channel back in September, and I want you guys to check him out. He knocks some pretty good people that are really uh, uh, usually up here on the countdown. Uh, he, even though there was a four-place tie here for 13th, he earned himself a right to be on the countdown. Congratulations, Jumpstart Gaming. Here's Mr. Consistency. Probably still the league, uh, the leader for the year, um, holding on here at 12th spot. Uh, again, there's a lot of videos being made, and DJ SAS had 17 points, uh, a four way tie here for the next uh, few spots, but with tie breaks, it puts it here. And DJ did, uh, a bunch of live videos which are two pointers and then of course all the dailies that he covers so well almost every day there's a few times he misses some but those are lower in um gamey daddy has had a great third quarter uh sometimes he's missed a few countdowns but he's also been way up there at the top a few weeks and he's doing pretty good he was here at 11th uh, tie breaks get him over DJ SAS, but not as good as the next two people. That uh, and Gamey Daddy has a lot of commentary. Um, he has a lot of discussion videos. Um, uh, not so much uh, streaming or uh, gameplay. Um, every once in a while, he'll do some kind of uh, build video or talking about stuff. But most of it is just content about the state of the game, the news, and everything like that. Now, Frog the God was number one last week, week 36. The first time he's been on top, he falls down here to we uh, to 10th. Um, again, tied with 17 points with the other two. And his, the, the sad thing is, the next person, uh, Frog, and uh, this person has... Uh, been at it and it just so happens they both have 17 points again and they're right here in the countdown and that is you know the vibes i don't make it i just report it they all had 17 points you know the vibes um had his weekly content that got him up here they get, that's the ultimate t t uh, tiebreaker and uh he uh, does some really good programming now frog the god he does more pvp um uh, more 
that kind of stuff so it builds about uh, uh pvp or the dark zone you know the vibes is kind of all over the place uh in a good way but one of the best things he does is on his streaming and, and that he really helps his community over there on playstation 4 so if you need a raid carrier i highly and you're on playstation 4 or 5 check out you know the vibes i'm sure you uh, uh follow him you're going to get some help in his behalf what up agents pure prime in eighth spot here pure prime uh, did a great job he had 18 points just one uh, better than all the guys right behind him and only two spots away from all the four guys that's behind him so there's only two points separates 10 people on this countdown um, so it's very competitive this week pure prime really out there turning it out this week for 18 points and he was tied with the Houston boy, I got your back. Uh, uh, games, or I got I G Y six games. Uh, one of the Houston natives. He does a lot of streaming, um, uh, build diversity, uh, some uh, raid carries uh, or raid uh, stuff he's done in the past. He is kind of an all round. Um, content creator and when he makes content he usually ends up here on the top 13 way to go uh, i got your six games now at six plot one of our league leaders uh year leaders in kazakami van doom if he's not first he's second uh, maybe a third but he's right up there with gamey daddy dj sas and uh, way above uh uh, people like myself, uh, maybe up there with GC Rock. G GC Rocks makes some grounds lately, but Kazakami Von Doom is up there. He's uh, got a lot of content coming out that he says, so expect a lot of content for him the last quarter, and I expect him to be right up there at the top. Anytime Gamey ends up here with 22 points, um, uh, Kamikaze had 19 uh anytime gaming has 22 points and he did a great job uh covering a lot of areas this week again this was a, a lot of videos to check out this week and i can see that uh, this next coming week is going to have a lot of content um just uh some new faces that are really hungry to get some videos made uh, new perspective and here's one of them right here his name's Beckett and he had 29 points his first time that we've recorded him on the countdown just recently found him um, and he's been making videos for a while but he's been kind of off the radar so i apologize for not catching up with this man earlier uh we'll hopefully get his support and hopefully see him on the content a lot uh right here in the countdown now je je tv is no stranger to the countdown but he's not always up here every week and for the longest time he had he ended up with uh, 32 points here but the problem is he would have even had a lot more but all his videos this week were build videos and you know after five we start marking off for each one after that we take one more point off of that so after five you only get three points and the seventh one you get two and then one and then nothing so uh, he would have been higher but Patrick Wolf was also had 32 points and he didn't lose any points on his videos um again j j e j e had he had some different content on there instead of 13 builds um again you kind of wonder how many builds you you throw out there when you're throwing out 13 builds and how good they are you guys can check those out but patrick wolf you know he's right up there and number one this week with 30 uh seven points on week 37 is gc rock now uh gc rock and patrick wolf 
did a lot of PTS, a lot of news, a lot of different the new videos, uh, a lot of the stuff that's happening in the PTS. Again, that was covered as um, uh, rated as news. So even if they had a build that was in the PTS, instead of getting four points, they only got three. And they still dominated. They're still first and second. So congratulations, GC Rock and Patrick Wolf. Now, as we close this out, I got some shout outs to some new people we found, and I want you to uh, check out that Abrex Gaming. Now, he's at 991 subscribers. So, if you would check him out, uh, that's A B R A X Gaming, that Abrex Gaming, uh, 991 points. So, if you uh, get a hold of him or find his channel, uh, please subscribe. Let him get over that thousand point. Tell him Bear sent you or Top 13, whatever, and uh, hopefully you can check him out. Now, some of the other guys that we've been seeing a lot of uh, recent new newness is is D Y L B A N, Midnight Rain, No Side, The Secret Scott, Eddie Chang and xycox uh big shouts out to all those new content creators that we've kind of seen um stop by check them out give them a good um uh, pat on the back for making content encourage them to be part of the community and it does look like all clear and present uh danger ahead it does look like division three is going to be out a few years from now maybe a year or two and we're going to need these content creators to get their game on and learn how to be really good content creators um, so they can be uh, viable later on so they need your support now let's let's before we close out the count now let's talk about some of the people that just missed the count now nothing but skills had 14 points along with chocolate chocolate panda gaming he had 14 points and just barely missed it. Counting on Jacob R24, Running Butcher, they're always up here. 12 points. Uh, Man of War, 11 points. And then there's a bunch of people at 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 points that just miss in the countdown. Now, one of the ones that I want to give a shout out to, and he didn't make any videos this week. Actually, two. Um, one of uh, two guys that I loved seeing it on the countdown there seemed to be very nice my interaction with both of them seemed to be um, limited but very good and that is DJ Tickle and uh, King Macho um, uh, both missed them making videos now the Macho's only made about four or five build videos in the last month and a half now I know he's had some uh, a sick a child that he's taking care of and obviously he knows his priorities are in his in his kids and that is really super so if you believe in prayer which i hope you do um uh why don't you send up a prayer for king macho and his family another thing you should check out and uh he came out of uh, his hiding is wids uh not with a lot of videos but I want you to check out uh, his probably clickbaitish video, but in the PTS he claims that he soloed, snipered a weapon for 114 million points for a sniper gun. So if that is true, I guarantee it's not going to make it out of the PTS. I just cannot imagine that they're going to let us shoot Razorback for 114, but it million with one shot. But if they do, you know, Bear Essentials, <laughs> Bear Buyer 65 is going to be out there pulling that old uh, shot, uh, that sniper build out, and he's going to be shooting. So that is week. 37 in the can i want you to congratulate uh, each and every person that made the countdown uh ek1 gaming by the way uh, 15 points just barely missed the countdown as well um there's a lot of people that uh, i wish we could give more shouts out and as we get to the end of the year 
we need to make sure that we're recognizing and encouraging all content creators. And let me also say that just because they make a lot of videos doesn't mean that they're best video maker. It's just how the points are. Some of the best content creators like NGN that does some great stories or Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer, they only do one or two videos a week or Cold Boy uh, Identity. These are all great content creators. They just don't make a lot of videos per week. They make the one, two videos and that's it. So this is Top 13 Content Creators Showcase. These are the people we showcase this week for the hard work that they've done. Please check out each and every content creator and give them their support. This is Bear Essentials and I am Bear Buyers and I'm out of here. You have a blessed day.